You know what it is, Beefy Banks, Beefy Low, <laughs> Eastside Long Beach, California. Hey, yeah, Sagzilla, yeah, baby. Yeah, Eastside yeah California, Long Beach, killer California Cali, Cali nigga. Yeah, we on the block, See, man. We it. on the block with it right Out. now. Fade in the building. No, Long Brian Beach P. in the motherfucking building. Cali in the building. Yeah, it's your boy Brian PF. You already know. Major games was the 20s and the insanes and uh, 19th streets at one time. You know what I'm saying? Uh, and this was the crip and that was dominating at, at a time. You know, it wasn't nothing on the north side. You know what I'm saying? When I used to go to the north side when I was young. You know, it was like going to, it was going uptown. It was like more cleaner up there to me. You know what I'm saying? From where I live. You know what I'm saying? You went up that hill of spring right there. You got Jim Crow. You got the Mercedes Benz dealership. All that shit. So it was like a total difference. It was like going downtown. You know what I'm saying? But now, you know, Crippin is everywhere in the city. So From know, the West and all that. Shout to the West, the East. But the North. East, this is where it really is. just like you said, originated. And it, it, and it expands everywhere. That's why we a Crip city. Because it ain't, ain't no bloods in our city. There's number of Crips on each side. West, North, East. It's, all, it's, it's, it's a Crip city. So how did, uh, what happened to the 19th streets? They got absorbed into one of the, the two bigger neighborhoods? No, nah, they're around. They're still around? They're around. But Everybody's the, around. Everybody's I thought it was just 20s and, and insanes. I mean, we more active. It's, I, I, I can say it like that. They, they around, I mean like, 19th street, what is right here? 19th right. street right here. They not, they ain't everybody hard to grew find. Up, everybody grew up around here. Everybody know everybody. It ain't like, you feel me? They right here. They fuck with both sides. You get what I'm saying? Like, they got family from both sides. And some niggas went to NSA, some niggas went to 20s. And you got some niggas that stayed 19th Street. But you had some niggas did all three. <laughs> yeah. You feel me? So. <laughs> um, <laughs> you feel me? All right, I had to laugh on that one, man. That's real, real shit. This, here, this is real shit, man. This shit. 19, 20, 21. Baby, man. So I was 15 when I first got put on 20s, you feel me? Shit, it was, nigga, I got to get down with two niggas, you feel me? I went round, you feel me? And, and why did you make that decision? Shit, I just, I got family from something, you feel me? That's, these my niggas, like. <laughs> so I was like 13. Yeah. I, I love to say it, you feel me? It was, uh, at that time, you know, I mean, I, I, this is where I grew, I grew up in it. So it was beef from over there or beef from here. And that's what it was, <laughs> nigga. Um, family really, uh, family kind of like influenced my decision, uh, you know, to, um, being involved in uh, gang culture. Uh, probably by like 13, you know what I'm saying? Um, been seeing it since, uh, <laughs> you know, I'm an 80s baby. I was born in 78, so I'm a little older. So, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you know, I've been seeing that shit since, you know, I could understand it. And only thing that I saw was that black and gold. Were your cards already dealt at a young age that this was the life mine, you were gonna be? I, I will. My, I will have, my I, mine was dealt like that, cause like I said, that that young and that that influence, I had a gang of the big homies around me. And where else I'm gonna go? I mean, who else I'm gonna fuck with? You know, this is who. Yeah. So you can't tell me I'm not from here. I'm I'm coming. Yeah. You know I mean, so yeah, they ain't had no choice really. To tell the truth, love my niggas. Um, shit, it was, I ain't gonna say my cards was dealt, you know what I'm saying, um, I made the decision, you know. You still had to make the, the, the decision, regardless, you feel me, if it was pressure, some niggas got pressure just being around, just hanging around a, a certain crowd, just being around them niggas every day, and be like, man, fuck it, it's, it ain't them niggas, you know, but some niggas was just entitled into it. So what you been up to since the last time we, we I'm finna go up? on tour. I, I go on tour in two days. Pop up fast. I mean, three days pop up fast tour with Snoop. Ooh, doggy dog. Is that me? right? Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's, let's talk about that. How'd you hook up with Snoop? And, I've been and... fucking with Snoop since last year. Since you met Java then, we all, yeah, he's the same. We always in the same boat. You feel me? It's just that, you know, little bro is his own right now. You know, little, you know, everybody get their shine. Little bro's doing this thing. Shout out to Java, you know, he's doing this thing. You feel me? And you know, we all came together, we did Beat City together. That's how we all became like fucking with each other. So what, what cities are you gonna hit on this tour? Kentucky, uh, Montana, South Dakota, Washington, fucking uh, Ohio, Vegas. Michigan, Detroit, we, we everywhere. 
Arizona. Arizona, all that shit. We everywhere. We going. We, we doing. You know, shows up up Cali. You know, we, we gotta represent Cali. Lake Elsa. And what's the name of the tour? Uh, Pop Pop Pass Tour Part Two. Okay. So you mentioned also Warren G's a part of the tour. He's he's not from far from where we at right now. G's up, right? Yeah, G, he grew up on Lewis. That's the big homie. Which is just a couple blocks away. A couple blocks right up here, Hill and Lewis. He a real good cat too. He a real dude, man. Got a good heart too. He a real nigga though. Shout out Warren. Right, what's up with these dogs, man? <laughs> they hate right now. They mad because we shining on their bitch ass. <laughs> hey, shut up! I'm just playing. Killing chihuahuas, baby. So you got a song out called what? Bang it. It's finna come it's out. Finna come we're out. We're finna drop soon. the video and shit. Yeah. Yeah. And what's it about? They got a, they got a couple, couple hoods in there. Shit, nigga. You feel me? Yeah, you know, we going across like L.A. to Compton and Long Beach and shit. You know, is you two on that? Nah, song? It's nah, five. It's of us. us from our hood. Yeah, from it. Then you yeah, got, but it's, it's three other. You got other people niggas. that from Power on it, and uh, and then you got like uh, a couple other another niggas another from, Broadway, from Broadway. Uh, other niggas, uh, I mean, like, not from Broadway, but from So Way Out. You know, fucking with uh, them niggas out there. Oh, G Perico. Yeah, yeah, yeah. G Perico. Yeah, YC Creed. Yeah, YC Creed. So you shout out to them niggas though. They doing their thing. They doing yeah, yeah. They doing their thing too. Real niggas. You see them shit. Oh, okay. Everybody don't sound the same. same. Everybody we got all got our own, own perspective style. on yeah. how we, where we come from, and what our session like, and what we doing over there, what they doing over there. So it basically like you feel me, like everybody, everybody showing like, yeah. oh, so you repping your shit like that? I'm repping my, my shit, shit like this. This is where I'm from, like you feel me? And that's just you know, it's a beautiful thing though. Niggas, everybody went hard. It wasn't nobody garbage on that Hell motherfucker. Yeah, to connect with different people. You feel me? But yeah. now, do you have a lot of younger homies trying to? They want to get on in, in music now because yeah. they see your yeah. lane is open yeah. enough. It's more of, yeah. But there's, it's there's, there's only so many people that you can handle, it's right? Only, yeah, it's, it's, it's only, but at, at the same time, you got to let that person get to where it's comfortable to bring y'all to the table. Right now, I'm working my way to the table. Me too. You got to let me get there and eat. <laughs> For everything to work, you can't let me get there by the chair and pull me back to the door. You can't do that. <laughs> you gotta let me get there and eat. Though. Have my feast and all. I'm, 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 I'm finna sit down in it. Let me eat, and then we all gonna eat. Oh, yeah. Now it seems that in the last year, year and a half, the guy that's got closest to the table from Long Beach has been Java. Yeah. And um, I guess that's a good sign. Yeah, right? it's a blessing. It's a blessing. Everything's a blessing. Everything's a blessing. You feel me? And it's good because it, it take it, it take niggas out to, to a better place in their life. Whatever they want to do. Thanks for watching StreetGangs.com. Please like and share the video you just watched and leave a comment below to tell us what you think. You can also watch two of our previous episodes to the right. Please visit the link to our Patreon page and support our campaign. And don't forget to subscribe.